This is going to be a demonstration of the Raspberry Pi Pico running the Sinclair ZX Spectrum emulator. So if I've got my Pico back here with a VJ connected into one side and USB keyboard connected into the other. I'll power it up, it should come straight up into the Spectrum. And I can type in the program. Prints the character out with a simple basic program. On my previous videos, I demonstrated the ZX80 and ZX81. And when I loaded stuff, they had to go for the tape drive interface. So it took a while for them to load. But on this one, I can load up snapshots. And they load up in instantly like this. So I'll just go through a few games. Just demonstrate a few games. The sound coming out of a little speaker on there, which is for my terminal, because uh, I wanted the terminal bell on my terminal, but I'm using it as a speaker for the X Spectrum as well. These kind of games really need a joystick to play. I'm kind of used to the cursor keys from way back in my youth. Still kind of remember, but I'm not that good at it these days. It's a lot harder on the keyboard, this kind of game. So this game, this um, time, we don't really have any source code to show because I've pretty much been through the source code. I'll have a bit of source code on the ZX Spectrum 128K and 128K plus 3 because that required a bit of changing around of some stuff. This one's kind of three D three D game. Gotta find the bad guy. Oops. 